So for day 18, meat. I want to touch on something that I rarely touch on in this channel, and that is how um, the beer bug, which I have to say because you two will probably get mad at me if I use the actual name, has affected the RPG scene. Now, obviously, with this whole th with this whole thing and everybody's and everybody's um, take on it. There's a bit of a trepidation about doing conventions. And while things like comics and things like art artists have definitely been hit hard with it, I definitely say artists because I'd say for a lot of um a lot of independent comic creators and the like, um the convention scene is how they get themselves noticed more so than any internet thing. But it's really, really hit hard when it comes to um people trying to kickstart or trying to get attention for their RPG projects. Because conventions are the lifeblood of that. It is through, is through conventions that they end up um, establishing connections, end up meeting other creators, end up sharing ideas with other creators. And while that's certainly possible digitally, um, a lot of people underestimate how much is lost when it comes to not being able to have that face-to-face -face conversation. Especially, especially since with um, the digital end of things, you're only getting so much out, out of that. And I realize the hypocrisy in me saying that kind of thing when so many of my own interviews are through digital means. But believe me, if I had the means and the funding to bring people over to Minnesota to do the interviews face-to-face, -face, you're going to be damn straight I would do that. I don't have that, fe I don't have that funds because I'm not some... I'm not some geek and sundry or some crap like that. And, to be honest, I never want to be. But the fact is, is that... I feel, I feel like um, this, whole, this whole digital thing... I do not want to see an emphasis on digital conventions in five years. Because I really think that the industry would be much worse with that than without it. I'm okay with it in the short term, but I don't want to see this becoming some sort of new normal or, or whatever claptrap somebody wants to hoist on the whole thing. 